Hey my friends, hope you're having a beautiful day. I wanted to do a review of this new Switch controller I got. Now it's not just for the Switch, it's also for the PC and Android. I'm told it's really easy to connect for those. I'm actually gonna use it uh, for work. Uh, but one of the things I wanted to showcase, it was super easy to connect to my Switch. I've used it so far, I've played a few games, uh, Mario Maker 2, including Mario Wonder. I'm a YouTube streamer, so I do a lot of game playing, and I'm always looking for new controllers. It seems like my official Nintendo controllers have eventually got a drift, so I'm always wondering what kind of budget, budget controllers I can get. The D-pad is pretty good. I will say it's a little bit stiff. I'm hoping it'll break in, but the analog controls are absolutely f fantastic. I love how it lights up as well. Uh, the two analog controls light up. For some reason it's not, as soon as I show it to you, it's actually just connected to my switch as soon as I push the button. It has the home screen, uh, the positive, negative, and uh, some extra buttons here that I have yet to figure it out. Of course, it has the, the standard bumper controls, and then you can program uh, these buttons, these extra buttons on the bottom. If you wanna do something fancy, you can figure out how to, to record those. But all in all, it's got like a, a solid rubber uh, housing uh, that feels really good. It's not super heavy, but it's not light either. It doesn't feel cheap. It actually feels really nice. Um, we had found it on sale on Amazon, and of course we had to buy it, and uh, I've, I've had a chance to test drive it a little bit. As well as in my family, I've got six kids, so we're always doing party games as well. In fact, we're planning a, a family Super Mario Party uh, gameplay, so it's good to have extra controllers for the Switch. The Joy-Cons are not my favorite. They're not my favorite to play with, and so I'm always looking for standard controllers to use for my Switch. So if you're looking for a budget controller uh, for the Switch that is wireless, and it's got rumble features, uh, you can connect it with the USB-C, uh, but it works fantastic wirelessly and is battery powered. And uh, I'm excited to actually use this for my uh, Steam Deck as well as my Android phones when I play games. Uh, really my Steam Deck, that's my other go-to. I'm a big fan of portable systems that you can connect to the TV. Uh, they're just awesome. So that's my review of this controller. Have a beautiful day.